magazine of the screen. One of a series of educational records of our time. Contributed as a public service by the Detroit News, the home newspaper. the sandy wastes at Yucca Flat, Nevada, a new series of atomic explosions are set off. Tanks are among the obsolete pieces of army equipment being tested in the exercises called Operation Teapot. More than 9,000 servicemen have been assembled to proving grounds, ready to take their places in forward trenches. In a grim new age of warfare, today's fighting men must be taught survival on an atomic battlefield. While the troops take cover, the Army's giant new 100-inch camera is pointed toward the blast tower. Men tensely eye the control booth as the seconds tick off. The familiar mushroom cloud snakes skyward, hurling the atom's deadly radiation high into the heavens. and shock waves roll over the men huddled in the trenches. Never before have we had such a close-up view. Lighting up the desert skies for miles around, the fierce fireball flare is the signal for instant action. Quickly, the men are ordered to leave their positions. The explosion's radioactive fallout is almost as dangerous as the blast itself. In the vitally important precaution of dusting each other off, the lowly broom becomes an item of military significance. Next, Geiger counters are used to check the troops for signs of radioactivity. Marching out of the shadow of the atom's awesome might come fighting men, symbolizing America's determination to keep strong.